I love you guys. I'm proud of you. Oh. Okay. Well, your pride may wither by Do you think? Oh Ready? God. We'll do all of this together. Ready? Oh, no. I can't read. Wildcats on three. One, two, three. Wildcats! Oh, God. Sorry. 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 In some ways, being the last graduating class of Concord, possibly, um, it's kind of bittersweet. It's nice knowing that we're the end of an era and I'm honored to be in that class, but it's also kind of sad knowing that everything that everyone up to this point has achieved is kind of, it's ending and it's hard. Thank you. Thank you. Go ahead, Linda. In light of the possibility of the school closing, we have tried to keep this as normal as possible for all of the students, not just the seniors, but the underclassmen, and for the community. I love the concept of a small K-12 community school. I love the Concord School and have always been willing to defend that love and I'm not alone. If we lose the revote, we won't have lost the battle. For as Tennyson said after a close friend died, is better to have loved and lost than to have never loved at all. Thank you. Being in the last graduating class uh, is very bittersweet. I think it's kind of a special opportunity to be that, but at the same time, I really don't agree with it because all my friends go here and some of them have to go to school for one more year at a different school and it doesn't seem right. Um, I think it's an honor and a disappointment to be part of the last graduating class of Concord. And uh, I think that it would be really sad to see Concord shut down as a high school. But, you know, it, w it would be, you know, if it had to go, it would be honorable to be the last graduating class but at the same time, I would love to see it stay open for the rest of my life and have my children go to Concord.